All right, it's pretty much here. The Del Mar Wine and Food Festival, first ever. It is an extravaganza featuring all the culinary feasts and specialties we have here in San Diego. We have athletes, we have so many things going on. And joining me right now is Troy Johnson, the founder. He's a Food Network personality, San Diego Magazine. And it's the San Diego Food and Wine Fest, but it's like Beef Fest today. What's going on here? All right, so this is the Brant Beef experience that they're taking on tour. Brant Beef is basically a San Diego ranch. They're based here. They, do, they have the ranch out two hours east but their headquarters are in san diego it's one of the best ranches in california in the country so we got a couple of the uh, better chefs in san diego got the bad boys of culinary over here we got ranch 45 over here they're going to be doing different bites this is going to be in the vip um the first taste that you're going to get on saturday and sunday at the grand tasting it's a little bit of steak and eggs when you say steak, steak and, eggs, and eggs nice look, what kind of caviar is that there uh, let's let's ask chef aaron the chef aaron from ranch 45 what do we got here so we have a brand beef New York, just seared, a little salt and pepper, and then we finish it with our house-made steak sauce, a little beluga caviar, and then uh, Chino Farms as a little uh, spring onion flowers. We're featuring local beef here, Brant Beef. Is this something that you feature at Ranch yeah, 45? So Ranch 45, we have a partnership with Brant Beef. All of our beef comes from them, third generation farmers. It's an amazing product. You know, I ask everybody that comes on uh, for this event, how cool is it to have this kind of celebration of food and cuisine in San Diego? It's awesome. It's finally bringing us all to the forefront, um, having national media and, you know, last week Forbes had us talking about the event, so it's pretty amazing. Yeah, we've turned into a food town, and guys like this bringing attention to it. All right, uh, Duval, what have you, you, have you, you were slicing with perfection here. What do you got here? So we got some brand beef smoked tri-tip, and then mixed in with some Caribbean spicy cabbage and uh, jerk barbecue sauce. Hey, hey, Chef Duval, are you from San Diego? No, I'm not, I'm from Virginia. How long have you been out here in this food scene? Off and on since the Marine Corps, since 99. Were you in the Marine Corps out here? Sure. Where, where are you stationed at? Uh, Miramar, Camp Pendleton. All right, thank you for your service, and thank you for being out here. So you've got to watch the food scene grow up here, though. No, I, I just uh, recently got into the food scene about seven years ago when I went to culinary school. Okay, so just recent. But seriously, what, what you're eating in 99, it's different than what you're eating now in 23. Absolutely different, absolutely. Absolutely. All right, now we got the we got the bad boys. Kelston, Chef Kelston, what are you guys going to be bringing to the event? Um, we're going to be bringing a lot of different flavors here. So we have flavors from uh, My Cuisine, Chef Duval, Chef Tony, and that's what really Bad Boys of Culinary is about, is bringing everybody together in the, in the hospitality um, community by highlighting African-American chefs and minorities um, to bring awareness through mentorship, sponsorships, events, and scholarships as well. Um, so we're bringing a lot of different stuff. I did the barbecue sauce. It's my dad's recipe. It's a rum um, jerk barbecue sauce and you know chef Tony brought his 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 famous pickled cabbage uh, Recipe, so you know, it's just a combination of all of us together putting our journey on the plate So this is a celebration of cuisine as we said in San Diego But how cool is it for you to get to celebrate and show everybody your collective what you guys are doing and how you are bringing food up? It's great. We're actually truly honored to be a part of this event. You know, um, we've been coming up here in San Diego in the food scene I'm not from here. I'm from Barbados But you know being able to be a part of an event like this just really showcases the melting pot of San Diego just showing how we all come together through food and, you know, just really humble to be here. All right. I'm, I'm going to have Troy tell us about some more things because I want to actually eat something. So, Troy, tell us the uh, what's happening tomorrow to kick things off. All right. So, tomorrow night, Wednesday night, is the big opening party. You want me to hold this? Oh, no, no, no. Don't touch my mic. Um, Wednesday night, that's going to be at Monarch Del Mar, like half of the Wave FC, San Diego Wave FC. All the professional players are going to be there. We've got bites around the deck at the, um, the Plaza in Del Mar. That's going to be the opening night. And the next, like, three days, Days, you've got 20 different events that are going around to San Diego. Like basically powerhouses like these, we put dream teams together in different restaurants leading up to the actual festival Saturday and Sunday is the grand tasting. All right, looking forward to it. I think we have a full screen up for everybody. Do you guys get to enjoy any of the food or are you guys gonna be working full time? Oh, we're going to enjoy and work. Okay, you're going to do both. Absolutely. Take shifts at the booth and stuff? That's it. All right. Looking forward to it. Thank you so much, guys. I'm going to eat some of the barbecue brisket with the sauce on it now. I'm going to send it back to Heather in there. But I, no, I don't even need a fork. I'm just gonna, is it okay if I eat it with my hands? Okay, i got to eat my hands because brisket is just like it's talking to me. All right, Heather, back to you.